Okay, guys, uh, it's time to start. Hello, welcome back to all of you. Hello, 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 hello. And uh, it is a pleasure having you here today. Today we're going to make a review or we're going to work on the meter of the section three, right? And we are going to see and be checking why all of those answers were the one that you select if they were good, if they were wrong. Nah, that's what we're going to check for today's. Let me see. I'm going to share the screen. Let me see. Oh, I have it right. I think it's this one, right? Okay. Da -da -da -da. Okay, now you can see it, guys. We are in the A, section A, listening. We have one, two, three, four, four questions in order to answer with the with the listening with the listening section. I'm going to play the the audio. We are going to pay attention what he the person telling, right? Sí. Yes. Okay. okay. Let's do it. Units one to two quiz. Part A. Listen to the conversations. Check the correct answers. One. Hi. My name is Anna Chang. Hi, Anna. I'm Zachary Young. Zachary? Hmm, is that Z-A-C-K-A-R-Y? No, it's Z-A-C-H-A-R-Y. Z-A-C-H-A-R-Y. That's right. Two. What's your phone number, Sue? It's 718-555-8871. I'm sorry. What's your phone number again? Seven one eight five 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 eight eight seven one. Thanks. Three. Brandon, what's on your desk? Oh, it's my CD player. It's cool. It's in your bag. Is it a cell phone? No, it's not. It's a camera. Oh, a camera. Nice. Four. Oh no. Where's my wallet? Is it in your pocket? No, it's not. Is it in your book bag? Um, yes. No, it's not. Wait a minute. Look under your desk. Yes, here it is, under your desk. Thanks. Um, okay, guys. Uh, I don't know if you want to hear one more time the, the, the audio in order to correct corroborate that we are I think we are good in the first one that we choose but we're going to play it one more time and after that we're going to check the the answer right units one to two quiz Part A. Listen to the conversations. Check the correct answers. One. Hi, my name is Anna Chang. Hi, Anna. I'm Zachary Young. Zachary? Hmm, is that Z-A-C-K-A-R-Y? No, it's Z-A-C-H-A-R-Y. Z-A-C-H-A-R-Y. That's right. Two. What's your phone number, Sue? It's 718-555-8871. I'm sorry. What's your phone number again? 718-555-8871. Thanks. Three. Brandon, what's on your desk? Oh, it's my CD player. It's cool. And what's in your bag? Is it a cell phone? No, it's not. It's a camera. Oh, a camera. Nice. Four. 
Oh, no. Where's my wallet? Is it in your pocket? No, it's not. Is it in your book bag? Um, yes. No, it's not. Wait a minute. Look under your desk. Yes, here it is. Under your desk. Thanks. Okay. We pay attention about what they were saying in the audio, right? Bueno. Gracias. Now, now we are going to see and check the, the answer for the Adiós, for, those, for, for those questions. What about her first name is? Three. Three. Two. Zachary. Okay. Zachary. Okay, uh, uh, after we're going to check the answer. What about Sue phone number? Is three. In the number three, okay, in the number three. What about the third question? It's the number three. Three, okay, camera. camera. What about the main wallet? It's the number one. Number one. Okay, now we're going to see the following. We're going to see the question. Now we're going to check right here. Oh, in this one? <laughs> yeah, you can see it. You see, Zachary, C-A-C-A-C-A-C-H-R-H-A-R-Y. And we confused with this one. Mm -hmm. It was Zachary, Zachary. Mm, in this one was good, the number two. And this one also was good, the camera. And under his desk. Okay, we are good on that section. Everybody got in that way? Yeah, or not. How many of you did get wrong? Why are you were doing the, the, the meter? All of you got a good grade, I, I imagine, right? <laughs> okay, let's go to move to the part B. Now we're going to see what we have in part B. Let's go here. Complete the conversation. Here we have a conversation. What is it? Complete the conversation. Uh, complete the conversation with the possessive, my, your, his, or, or her. What can we say right here in this one? Tony is, this is my friend. Her name is, my her name. Her name. Her name. Her name. Her name is, Jennifer. is Jennifer Miller. Miller, okay. That's part of the possessive one. Okay, what about in the number two? Jennifer is... In, in English class. In our, in our English class. In our English class. Mm -hmm. in our in our English, English class. class. Okay. Tony, nice to meet you. Mm -hmm. What's your last name? What's your last name? Okay. It's Miller. Miller, let's go to check the, the possible answer that we have here. Okay, now we are going to see. Okay, guys, here we have some of the possessive. And, okay, uh, Tony, this is my friend. Her name is Jennifer Miller. Guy, why we are using her instead of his? Mm -hmm. Her, ella, his mm -hmm. else. She, 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 her, her female, uh, his uh, man. Oh, Cecilia said that his it is used only for men. In here, it is used for woman. For woman. Woman. Mm -hmm. But that those are the possessive that are according with the genre. 
in this case, those possessive have a general. Uh, what does this mean? That you can say to his when you're talking about her. You could, you cannot say to. We can work in the opposite way, right? If you're talking a, a man, you're you're not going to respond like a girl. If you're talking about a girl, you're not going to answer like a man. Her in Spanish is the uh, su de su ella. De ella. Y, but what about his in Spanish? Is the su de él. Is the su de. That's why we are going to try to keep in your mind how all of this structure really works. Okay. Now we're going to see here. And Jennifer is in our. In or or in or in or or because we are talking about in a plural, we are making emphasis that she is between a large amount of people or a large group. That's why we refer or. That's why we take like into a part like like the word or the possessive better say right. Okay, what about the third one? Tony, what's your, your, your name? What's your name? If you see, you have three different ways in which you can write uh, your. You can, in this case, uh, how we can, we understand uh, that we really have to use yours. Because if you're if you already see here we also we have the contraction for of what is but here we have it contracted. You can you can say another, uh, you can say again what is last name? No 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 because that's not match as I was mentioning to you the the class. Remember the after the double question we have the four of the verb to be. According to what we were talking about, is this one is singular, this one is plural. If we have a contraction, we are not going to double the for the verb, the verb to be. No, 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 no. That won't happen. Why? Because we already have it. That double uses in the in the same place that doesn't match that 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 won't work. Yeah. That never is who's talking? Oh, uh, okay. That's why we select your. What's your last name? name. What's name. your last name again? Okay. It's Miller. It's Miller. Remember what we're talking about? Also, it's like a combined uh, combination between like uh, the processing and double question, I think. Okay, now we are going to move to our next part. I don't know if everybody did good. Uh, oh, how many of you have correct the, all of the three of them? All of you? All of you guys? Nobody, nobody made me say in, in these three sentences. That, that also. That's great. Okay, now we are going to check the bar. C. Okay, we have the C bar. Okay, fill in the blanks with the correct four of B, which are the three four of the verb to be. Mm -hmm. Which are the three four guys? Um, is are is are you? Excuse me, are you Miss Brown? No, 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 no! Don't confuse the three four of the bird to be here. Mm -hmm. Um, are and is. Just are three. Uh, Just are uh, three. Am, um, are, and is. 
Those are the three, four of the verb to be. There's no more. The three, four of the verb to be. That's it. The other one are the subject that complement the verb. Subjects are different things. Verbs are another one. Okay? Okay. Mm -hmm. Remember, after the subject, some cases, the verb follows the subject. When we have at the beginning of the sentence, the for the verb to be, that means that that is going to be a question. That's it. But even if you have a double question, and after the double question, you have whatever for the verb to be, that also means that it's going to be a question too. Okay, let's go to see what we have here. Excuse me. Are you Miss are Brown? Are you Miss Brown? Mm -hmm. And we are going to see later. Miss Brown. Oh. This brown looks like uh, the brownies, right? Brown, brownies. Brown. <laughs> like the one the, the wheat. Okay, no. No, I am not. No, no, no. I am no, not. Are not. Or you can say, no, I'm no, no, not. No, no. no I'm not. Mm -hmm. Okay, we are good. Let's continue. Let's see this one. He over there. Is he's over there. He's over there. He's over there. No. He's over there. She's over there. Okay. Here over there, Over there, my name is Nicole Parne. Here, here over there. Uh -huh. Let's keep in the way. The, after that, we're going to check. Here is over there. My name is Nicole Parker. So she's, she's, she's over she's, there. She's, she's over there. She's over there. Okay. Let's keep in that way. She's over there. That's it. Now we're going to see this one. Oh, I'm sorry. Well. It's nice to meet you. It's nice to meet you. It's nice yeah. to meet you. Too. Nice to meet you too. <laughs> Okay, now we're going to see and discuss why all of these ones were correct. Now we, we're going to see, now we're going to check. Okay, what we have here. Oh, you see, excuse me. Oh, are you Miss Brown? Okay, we were good. You, you see, guys? No, I or I am. Or I'm in capital letters. Oh, oh. Jeez. You see, we Jeez. have a, a lot of a lot of different ways to answer. Cheese, 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 cheese or cheese. You can with capital letter with contraction. Full capital letter just with a capital letter at the beginning. Oh, we have a. One, two, three, four, five different ways in which we can answer this this question. Okay, we were good, guys. What about here? Oh, I'm sorry. Well, it's nice to meet you. It's nice to meet you. Oh, also, we have three ways, like this one. It's nice to this meet you. This one, and we can we can put it also in the hole. In capital letter. Okay. You already finished the section C, right? We're going to move to the section D. Check the the correct response. The correct response. What we have here? Goodbye. Have a nice day. <laughs> Mm -hmm. One, two, and three. 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 
Thanks, you? You too. Two. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. remember, the number one, we select the number three. What about the number two? See you later. Okay, okay. bye bye. Bye bye. Later be. There will be in this case. Okay, bye bye. Bye bye. Let's go to see what we have over here. Let's make a and see what. Hi, how are you? Not bad. Not bad. Nice, nice bad. to meet you. Not bad, Not bad. Thanks. thanks. Okay, remember that. Not bad, thanks. Okay. What about the number four? Good evening, Beth. Good night. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good evening, Beth. How are you, Mr. Smith? Good night. See you tomorrow, Mr. Smith. Hello. How are you? Mr. Hello. How are you, Mr. Smith? <laughs> now we now we're going to see which might be the the correct answer. And we have it right here. Okay. You see, guys, in the first one, you were right. Goodbye. Have a nice day. Thanks. You? You too. Thanks. You too. Number two. See you later. Okay. Bye bye. Okay. Bye bye. Bye bye. Uh, hi, how are you? Not bad. Thanks. bad. Not bad, thanks. Not bad. So far, so good. So far, so good. It means, más o menos, so far, so good. Mm -hmm. We can say another way, right? Mm, what about this one? Good evening, Beth. Hello, how are you, Mr. Smith? And some of you said, good night. See you tomorrow, Mr. Smith. Smith. Uh, always try to pay attention at the moment where you are uh, talking or referring about the grammar structure. And even we have like a infer uh, what else we can have like a, like a meaning in those cases. In this case, the person is giving a giving a hi, right? Or giving a, a, a greeting. And if you give a greeting, the another person is going to respond to you. <laughs> That's mean that the, the most proper one has to be the one that we decide to select, right? Okay. We complete the section D. D. C. Okay. So we have right here. Complete the question and answer correctly. What we have here, complete the question and answer correctly. And guys, what is this structure, the one that we have here? This. No, 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 no. It's... Carlos. Where? Remember how we call it this structure, the one that we have here? With our, our w question. There who, who, who said that? Double... Plural. W question. Who said that? Jocelyn. This. Yeah. What are these? Right. right Plural. Then. We are this. Uh, please write raise the hand the one who said double question with her levante uh, la mano el que dijo double question yo oh you, you okay thank you Helen. thank you yeah <laughs> you were paying you were paying attention about the structure double h question with b why would b teacher what is this? It is a four of R. No, this is R. Bert, Bert. Bert this. No, wait, guys. Wait, 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 wait. This is R. But it is a four of what? Es la forma de quién o de qué? Mm -hmm. Plural. ¿Qué son? 
Plural, entonces cheese. No. Remember Do that I mentioned to be? is sorry. The bear to be belongs to the four of the bear. The complement to be. Those who are this one belongs to the four of the bear to be. That is where it belongs. Remember, we're talking about the worst question with be. What does it mean? We are going to use whatever or any kind of the worst question with the form of the verb to be. What is, what are. Remember, how we are going to use it? We are going to use the worst question and the form of the verb to be according with the subject that is going to be after the form of the verb to be. Because if you have is, and after is, you're going to talk about a plural. You can you can use is because is, it is only used for? Singular. For singular, okay. What about the case of are? If you are using the first question, plus are, plus a singular noun, it is that correct? No. no. No, because R, it is a? Plural. It is a plural, because R, it is a plural. What about the case of am? Um? Remember, in this case, we double question, we uh, we don't use it like, uh, like an, in a wide way, but you can say, what am I doing here? What am I doing here? ¿Qué estoy haciendo aquí? What am I doing here? We have am because the subject is I. And who is I? Is the first person. The famous job. That means I. Each of them goes according with the subject that they are going to refer. That's it. And as we remember, those question will be, it's nothing out of this world. This is something very common, something very popular, something that is used most of the time while you were talking, speaking, or you were giving a speech. Those question will be, I think, are the, the popular ones. The popular one in order to work with the grammar structure. Okay, there we have the question. There we have what <laughs> are what is going what we are going to continue here. This 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 number three. Number three. Yes. Why do you think it is? Plural. Mm -hmm. Plural. Estos esos. This is this. 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 Number three. This is in, in this case it is singular plural. or it or it is plural. 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 Mm -hmm. What about the case of, of the one that it's we have singular. here? Singular. 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 Yeah. But remember that we also we were talking about how far they were, right? The distance, where the object were. Remember that, right? As I was telling you, eh, what is this? What is this? This. This. Mm -hmm. this, this is this. The this, first one. This. The cerca. one that I, the one, sorry? This, eh, cerca, y, y this sería lejos. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This, this, for close, for close. And Claudia said that the second one, this is far away, right? It's far away. You say that, right, Claudia? Yes. Teacher. We're teacher. talking. Okay. Hello, Amen. Silvia. 
este en plural en español yo le entendí que el dis es plural y el dis singular entiendo o entendí que era cerca disua porque una es singular y otra es plural es lo que yo entendí uh -huh. that's what I want to hear I, that's what I want to hear from you if you really remember that part because one thing is that you remember what this really means and another thing is that you remember the proper uses of this one okay I don't know if you got it Cecilia <laughs> what uh, Ah, lo que buscaba era que me entendieran no solo el significado sino que los usos uh -huh. that's, that's why I was doing this eh, because what I was looking for was that you really remember not only the meaning guys not only the meaning also the proper uses of this structure according how to how they are, they are going to be used and why we are going to use it in this way, how we can refer, uh, if we are talking about something far away or something that is close. And I see that some of you uh, keep that idea in, in your mind, but always try to remember that. Always, always, always try to keep it in that because there might be some time that you just only might say, uh, I don't remember why, but, the only thing that I remember is the translation. <laughs> That's why you always remember the two the two part of them, right? Okay, we said what are what we say the number one? What are this? This three. The no number three. The number three. Okay. Thank you. I'm going to see who else we have here. Arana. Okay. We have just oh, oh Angel. We have like a twenty one. Okay. Okay. Let's move a little bit here. Okay. This is the answer of this first question, right? Mm -hmm. How we are going to complete this one? Dairy. Uh -huh. Why there? Why this one? Dairy. Number two. Yeah, but, but why? Why? Because it's plural. Because it is plural. It is plural. Who's in the same? They are staring. They are, they are plural, said Jocelyn Edith, right? Who else, is, uh, who else is agree with Jocelyn? Uh, because are two. Yeah, Jocelyn, Jocelyn, you are, you are saying that there are two and they are plural. But I don't know if the other one are agree with you. Plural. Okay, Henry said plural, who else? Mm. Dalila, you said plural? Yes. Okay, plural. Douglas? Oh. Plural. Douglas, what do you say? It's plural. Teacher. Mm -hmm. También podría ser it's because um, it's a uh, object, objetos, o no sé. No. 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 ¿Por qué? I'm, going to, I'm going to explain you why. Because if you remember, we 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 have like a like a pat pattern. First we have the question, and after we have the answer. Answer. The question it is in singular or in plural? Plural. Plural. Okay. Plural. Le, the, le, uh, after that, we move to the uh, following answer. 
how we are going to answer to a plural question. No, es que pensé que también podría ser it's porque it's se refiere como a o se usa para objetos. Yeah, you you are right with that one, but I'm going to tell you this. It refers to object, but in this case, it is like a just for a, a short question, and especially if it, this one it is plural, it cannot be applied. It can be applied in a sentence or in a text. Maybe when you have a, a whole text in a book, that might apply. But here, like a short, a very short answer, that won't apply because here uh, you have you have the like a like a clue earrings here we we don't have it in singular we don't have it we have it in in plural that's why you don't you can say this and also you can do this you can do this one their mm -hmm. earrings because the question is in plural plural in plural my apply only okay. it in the case will 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 be different if you have it here like a singular you can answer with a singular because mm -hmm. our short short answer in this case but in the case that uh we're referring to plural no it's like uh doesn't match and uh, doesn't match that's why we can use but we are going to check it later okay what about the number two Is, your song. Are your, your sunglasses? One, or two, or three? Three. three? three. And how is said the number three? Are these plural? Plural. Are these your sunglasses? Okay. Let's keep in that way. It is a plural. What about here? This is the answer. No. They are not. They are not. They are not. not. Why they not? Why we use they not? Because the answer is are these in plural. Mm -hmm. Are in plural? Who who are seen the same like Jocelyn? Put her seeing the same like Jocelyn. Nobody else? No, entendiste, Doris. Porque la pregunta, ustedes dijeron que era are these, entonces anteriormente él dijo que la respuesta es similar a la respuesta en plural o en singular, entonces elegí, elegí either they o ustedes eligieron they porque al principio dijeron are these. Yeah, well, we we can keep it in that way, right? Are your sunglasses? Are these your sunglasses? And the answer, no, they're, they're not. They're not. Okay, let's move to the number three, and then going to see what we have here. Is this? Is this? This is this. number two. Number two. 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 Is this a notebook? Mm -hmm. And what we have here at the beginning? What we have here? The form of what? One. La porque, forma. Se, porque se uh, refiere a un objeto y que es solo uno. Singular. Singular. Yeah, I, I, I got your idea, but why, what do I have here? This, this, how, how do I call this? Is this a notebook? Because is, is singular? Mm -hmm. uh, no. This, um, uh, as a reference a, a a a bird, bird to be, <laughs> is? Mm -hmm. Remember. Belongs to the form of the verb to be. to be. To be. Okay. 
what we're talking about if we have the form of the verb to be at the beginning of, of the sentence. It I'm might be a, in this case. A question. It is a question. In the cases when we have the form of the verb to be at the mm -hmm. beginning of the sentence or an statement, that means that we are going to make a question and also what gi give us the idea in the question mark. The question mark also give us the idea that we are doing or we are structuring a question. That's it, okay? Is this a, no, would you say, right? Okay, what about, what about the number three? No, no it is. Number two. Number, two. Number, two. Number, two. number two. And other books. And other books. And second. Number three, three unders. Second. Number two. Number two. Number two. Three unders. No, it isn't. It's. And. Um, it's. No, it isn't. Ah, it's the umbulan. It is a notebook. It is a notebook? No, it isn't. It's an address. Um, uh, it's an address. Who said D? It says Verse three. Who said D? Who said D? Joe, number three. He Henry? Yes. Ah, you said number three, Henry? Yeah. Porque no es una, una, no es una pregunta. Uh -huh. Solo está diciéndose que es un libro. Uh -huh. Solo de el libro. El uh -huh. Andrés Book. No, perdón. El, el directorio. Uh -huh. Yeah, you, 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 are, you are getting the idea. Okay, I, I understand you. Okay, thank you, Henry. Now we are going to see the moment of the truth. Ta, 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 ta. Pa, na, na, na. Now we're going to see here what we have. Okay, did you see guys? What are? This. 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 Mm -hmm. Remember? Later. 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 Jocelyn, you see? Hola. <laughs> you, see what, yes. you, you see why we, we can use it, right? Uh -huh. Okay, remember that, uh, Jocelyn. The, what gives you the key? It is always the singular or, or the plural that is accompanied in the sentence. Okay, I got it. Okay, okay, you got it. What about the number two? What's correct, right? Correct. Are these your song? Sunglasses. Okay. And the answer was? They they're not. No, they're not. They're not. Mm -hmm. No, we won't, we are we, we are not going to use is or it. No, 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 no. Because remember, first you were doing a question in plural. In in which in which way you are going to answer? You're going to answer also in a plural. Singular. Who says singular? <laughs> No, no, okay, let's continue. What about here? Is this a notebook? Uh -huh. This is what I like a little confused, remember? No, no, it is, it isn't. It's an address book. Who remember this guy? Porque, porque, porque lleva vocal, palabra siguiente, vocal. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you remember how, how was this applied. If we only have the article A, we can use it because the, this word mm -hmm. starts with a, with what? With a? Consonant. With a vowel. <laughs> with a vowel. With a vowel. With a vowel. When we have a word or a sound that starts with a vowel, you're going to use the article and when you have uh, any letter uh, 
especially in this case, the one that are consonant, you're going to use a. That's mm -hmm. everything that you have to keep in your mind. And with vowel. Yeah. Uh, with consonant. No. That's it. That, that will be everything. But the majority, so that was the article, the address, boom. But we are making emphasis about the, the article. Ah, ah. Okay, now we already finished the section E. Now we have to move to the... Oh, sorry. Let's see what... He... Teacher, y para descargar el, el manual, este, hay que llenar un papel. Es que yo le di descargar y me mandaron un mensaje ah, como case, autorización. Huh? Ah, no, porque sure, lo querían but... dar en mi teléfono, pero, pero, pero pues no sé. Y después ya no contesté, ya no lo descargué. I, I'm, not, I'm not sure about that, but I can, I can share you the, the, the number of the girl technical support. And send me a message and I, I will send I will share you the, the contact of the one that is in charge of everything according with this with the platform, for right. Uh, okay, let's continue. What we have right here. Oh remember what we we're talking about. Look the picture, complete the conversation, select the correct preposition. Remember the preposition, right? We have on them. Tell me some of them. Tell me some of them. Um. On. Um. Mm -hmm. What else? On. Um. On. Um. Under. Under. Behind. 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 Next to. Behind. In front of. Behind. In front of. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Next to. Next to and in front of, we already mentioned it. Under. 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 Uh -huh. In. In. In front. In front. Okay. Now we have to move to this section, right? Where are the keys? The keys are they. They um, what? Um, oh. Um, um, okay. Oh. Um, oh. Um, oh. Um, oh. Um. Is the CD player behind the briefcase? Next. No. It's not. It's. Next. Next to. Next to. Next to the briefcase. Okay. What about the number three? What is the newspaper? Where we have the newspaper? Under the briefcase. Under. Under? Under the briefcase. Under the briefcase. Mm -hmm. Under the briefcase. What about the number yeah. four? Are the books in front? In front, in front. In front of the CD player. Mm -hmm. Now we're going to check what we have. Let's going to see what we have here. Where I have the answer? Okay. Show me the answer. Yeah. Remember? There on the briefcase. Mm -hmm. Is the CD player behind the briefcase? No, it's not. It's next to next to the briefcase. Next to the briefcase. What is the newspaper? Is it it under is the briefcase? Under the, the briefcase. The briefcase. Are the books in front of the books? From, oh yeah, from, yes. Yeah. In front of the CD player. player. In front of the CD player. Okay, thank you, guys. Now we're going to move to letter G. Let's go to see what we have in letter G. Complete the conversation. 
with the correct answer. Write the correct answer, sorry. A conversation. Hey, Hirochi, are you in Michael from Japan? Yes, we are. We are. Yes, we are. Okay. Oh. Are you from Tokyo? Are you from Tokyo? You're from Tokyo. No. no. Oh, are you from Tokyo? Are you from Tokyo, huh? No. No, I am not. No, we are. No, we are not. No, we are not. No, he said, oh, are you from Tokyo? No, we are no. not. Mm -hmm. This, see what we no, have here? We are not. Plural. Plural. Mm -hmm. Okay. What about here? From Kyoto? We are. How? We are. are from Tokyo. Yeah. They are from Tokyo. We are. We are from, from Tokyo. Okay, now we are going to check the correct answer. If you see, Hirochi, are you and Michael from Japan? Yes, we? We are. Um, we are, okay. Mm. Or? Oh, are you from? Are you from Tokyo? Okay. No. We're, We're not. not. Mm -hmm. We're, We're from, from, Tokyo. Tokyo. from Tokyo. Remember, what <laughs> gives you the idea, what gives you the clue how you're going to answer is the, is the word that is before the one that you're going to use. That's the thing that, that are going to help you a lot at the moment to answer those questions. I, I think that some of them were understandable. They were easy to understand. They were not something out of, the, of this world, right? Okay, we have the last section, letter. We have the letter H. We have the letter H. Let's see what we have here, guys. Now we are going to check what we have here in the last section. What's up? This was a very large or, or long meter. Let's complete the conversation. Using what guy? Double H? Question. By selecting the correct question. Okay, conversation. Look. Who's mm -hmm. that? Who's, Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Oh, he's a new student. A student. Okay. What's his name? What's his name? What's his name? What's his name? Okay. <laughs> Where he from? 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 Okay, next. Now we're going to check the answer and see why we have those one. Okay, now we are going to check something, guys. Okay, if you see, look. Who's that? Who's that? What what it means who's guys in translating into Spanish? What it means who? Who? Just who? Yeah. Remember? Quien is? Quien is? No, just only who? What it means translating into Spanish? Just only who? Quien? Uh -huh. Is quien? But in this case, what we are talking about who? And we are using the verb to be is, but in a contracted way, because we are talking about in singular. We are talking about singular. We use whose, that is the contraction for of who is, because we are talking about a singular. 
teacher, how, how can I know that I really was talking about singular? Because here at the beginning, we were talking about who is, who is, and who he, who, oh, he's a new student. What does it mean? That is just only talking about one person. A in a singular, in a singular form. We are not talking about a plural. We are talking about singular form. That's why we are going to use who's instead of who are, right? Okay, we have the next one. I think his name is Shen Kuo. What was the answer? What his? His name. His name. His name. What's his name? So this, this is the contraction for of, of what? This is the contraction of what? what Here we have. What Here is, we have of what is what is remember what with this apostrophe right here in the in the upper side side of the word means a contraction of, of what of what is remember what is what is name in this case we are talking about in singular or we keep also talking about in plural. Singular. 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 Remember, guys, if you have a question that is doing or it is uh, turning to you in a single form, you are going to answer in a single form. If you have in a plural form, you are going to answer in a plural form. Those are the changes that this one might apply. Okay. Uh, what's his name? Ki Chien Kuo. That's mean? Where? Where is? 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 from and from. that's and that's everything okay remember the double question guy who what and where remember that in the class we were talking about that uh the three of them were the most popular but we have a large list of all of them this one are the three most popular that's everything that is going to be uh all uh, I don't know if we have a question, we have something to add, you would like something to discuss, and I don't know how you are in the platform. Remember that yesterday I was telling to you to to keep working on the platform, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go to close right here. We have 23 with me, but you only are 22. And from the hole that we have here, just write your, your finger, your hand, in order to know that all of you complete uh, until today uh, or those days ago, the section three. Who already finished completely the section three? Raise your hand, I want to see. The mm, another. Uh -huh. mm. You have until tomorrow to finish. Dayanara, you haven't finished the section three? Dayanara, Yamilet? No. Okay, you have until tomorrow at midnight in order to finish the section three. Try to try to work on it in a in a in a little space, or maybe after the after the class you can work a little bit on that. If you already see. The question were not like uh, out of this world. Those ones were very, very easy. Henry, you hadn't finished, but as I told you, you have until tomorrow at midnight in order to finish, right? Mm -hmm. okay. 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 Marlon, Douglas, Carlos, you, you finished, right? Why? Okay. Carlos Eduardo, you are done with the... Okay, you're done. And... Um, Dalila, you said you're 
You're good, right? Uh, Annabel, you are. Eh. Ok, you are good. No, 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 no es la. Es, es, por momentos hubo bajón de, de la señal y solo escuchaba un ruido. Eh, oh. Pero me quedé, estaba preguntando en qué lección íbamos. Yo, yo oh. estoy con la 2.8. Ah, pero you have time until tomorrow, ¿ok? Sí. Ok, no te preocupes por eso. Génesis, ok, Alex, al, Alexandra, you, you already completed, ¿verdad? Right? Yes. Eh, Jocelyn, you too, ¿verdad? Right? Yeah. Well, guys, eh, I think this is was everything for today. Please try to all of you be on time. I know that you maybe are coming from work, but try to be on time in order to start the classes because in that way it might be better for for you, right? In order you won't lose anything about the class. Thank you, I really appreciate your participation, everything what you were sharing with me. I hope to see you in God allow us on Monday, right? Okay. On Monday, okay. in the same Goodbye. platform, the same time. Okay, have a good night, Thank guys. You, Take care. Thank you, I hope teacher. to see you good tomorrow. Night. Good night. Bye. Bye, 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 guys. Bye-bye. See you. Bye. Take care. Bye.